Have you ever wondered what the difference between a frog and a toad is? It's a question that has puzzled many of us for years. You see, in our everyday conversations, we often use the terms frog and toad interchangeably, as if they were the same thing. We look at these small hopping creatures and assume they're all just variations of one another. But that's not quite accurate. In the grand tapestry of the animal kingdom, frogs and toads are unique threads, each woven with their own distinct characteristics. Yes, they are both part of the same amphibian family, but they are different species. Each has its own set of fascinating traits, behaviors, and adaptations that set them apart from each other. So, while they may seem similar to the untrained eye, frogs and toads are quite different creatures. And as we delve deeper into their world, these differences will become even more apparent. Let's dive deeper into understanding our friendly amphibian, the frog. Frogs have a distinct set of physical features that make them easily recognizable. Their bodies are covered in smooth, moist skin, often vibrantly colored, a stark contrast to the rough, bumpy skin of their toad cousins. Moreover, frogs are renowned for their long, powerful hind legs, perfect for leaping great distances. These leaps are not just for show, they're a crucial part of their survival strategy, helping them swiftly escape predators or catch prey. Speaking of prey, frogs have a broad diet that includes insects, small fish, and even other frogs. They play a vital role in maintaining the balance of the ecosystem, controlling insect populations and serving as a food source for larger predators. Frogs prefer living near water bodies, from tranquil ponds to rushing rivers. This is because they lay their eggs in water, which later hatch into tadpoles. As you can see, frogs have a unique set of characteristics that set them apart. Now, it's time to hop over to the world of toads. These fascinating creatures are often mistaken for their froggy cousins, but they have their own unique set of characteristics. Toads, unlike frogs, have dry, bumpy skin that's more reminiscent of a desert landscape than a pond surface. Their legs are shorter, built more for walking and short hops rather than long leaps. Their habitat preference also sets them apart. Toads are at home in drier environments, where they can burrow into the ground and hide from the midday sun. Despite this, they are still water-dependent for breeding and will seek out water bodies during the rainy seasons. When it comes to diet, toads are not picky eaters. They will happily gobble up insects, spiders, slugs, and even small mice. Their voracious appetite plays a crucial role in maintaining the balance in our ecosystems. Just like frogs, toads have their own distinct features and lifestyles. Now that we've explored both frogs and toads, what sets them apart? Let's dive in and recap the key differences. One of the most noticeable distinctions is their skin texture. Frogs have moist, smooth skin, often appearing shiny and slick. On the other hand, toads wear a coat of dry, bumpy skin, which may give them a bit of a rugged look. So if you spot an amphibian with a smooth, glossy exterior, it's likely a frog. But if it's sporting a rough, textured skin, you're probably looking at a toad. Next up, let's talk about leg length. Frogs are the long jump champions of the amphibian world. Their long, slender legs are perfectly designed for leaping great distances. Toads, however, have shorter, sturdier legs better suited for walking or short hops. So, if you see an amphibian hopping far and fast, it's probably a frog. But if it's ambling along or making small hops, it's likely a toad. Let's move on to habitat preferences. Frogs are water lovers. They're often found near ponds, lakes, streams, and even in wet areas of your garden. Toads, on the other hand, are more terrestrial and prefer drier environments. They're typically found in gardens, woods, and fields, away from bodies of water. So, if you find an amphibian by the water's edge, it's probably a frog. But if it's far from water, it's likely a toad. Lastly, let's touch on diet. Both frogs and toads are carnivorous and eat a diet of insects and small invertebrates. However, toads have a broader diet and will eat anything they can swallow, even harmful pests. Frogs are a bit more selective and prefer live, moving prey. These differences, while seemingly small, play a significant role in distinguishing between frogs and toads. They each have unique characteristics that make them special and perfectly adapted to their preferred lifestyles. So, the next time you see a small amphibian hopping around, you'll be able to tell whether it's a frog or a toad. We've uncovered the fascinating world of frogs and toads today. We delved into their unseen differences, took a closer look at the vibrant life of frogs, and got acquainted with the unique traits of toads. Despite their striking similarities, we've learned that frogs and toads are indeed distinct creatures, each with their own unique characteristics and roles in our ecosystem. 
Remember, knowing the difference between a frog and a toad is just one step in understanding the incredible diversity of life on Earth.